first power up. Just gonna run the fan for right now. Get the fan going. Where's my fan speed? So uh, I'm just finishing up with the vacuum. D2DNY, real world HVAC simplified. Uh, so there's the finished connections. All the wires have been connected already. Indoor and outdoor, I'm just finishing up with the vacuum. I'm about to open the refrigerant, open the gas soon. Okay. Let's walk outside. Again, this is another Douglas Mini split installation video. So I'm evacuating right now, pulling a vacuum. This is a vacuum pump. For all you do it yourselfers, you gotta do a vacuum before you open the refrigerant. I open the refrigeration valves right here. Before you open these valves, you gotta pull a vacuum. So, I think I'm pretty much good. Here's the wires on the outside. So, and the color code is not arbitrary. Just do it. Make sure you match one, two, three with one, two, three, or one, two, and signal in this case. See one, two, and sig, match it up. You know indoor and outdoor color coded match but you can use whatever color you fancy and in the bottom in the bottom terminal is my power supply to it 230 volts this particular unit yeah so i'm gonna go ahead now turn my vacuum pump off you know i'm gonna close this down Off. And you can see my vacuum is holding. It ain't going back up. That means I have no leak. If you, if this if this number starts to go up into the positive, that means there's a leak. So that's good. Now it's time to open the refrigerant. So this is the first valve I'm opening. Go all the way and make sure it's snug. All right, so this one here now. I'll secure those caps because you're gonna need them once the job is completed. I believe they're the same size. Let me see here. They're the same size. Yep, same size. And this is a. What size is this? This is a. I don't see the size on this thing. Right, let's just open that. And open just make sure it's snug okay, uh, I like to get a size of this thing here actually from the set here four millimeters okay that's my standing pressures are 14 a okay let's get back downstairs and get the heating started Is, uh, it's winter time right now. It's cold out here. I'm going to close this thing. 
I don't know to close that, but anyways. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn on. Got the fan blowing right now, just fan. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the heating on for the very first time. Like a virgin. Turned on for the very first time. <laughs> I'm just stupid, right? So I'm gonna mode heating. Voila. And just raise my set point all the way up. Oh, you see the light changes as well. The, you know, that's the heating changes to amber. So I'll raise it up. Maximum heat, 86. There you go. And I guess whenever I receive the signal, it goes blue. Yeah, pretty cool. All right, let's go see her. Compressor's turning on for the first time. So you see the pressures? heating mode okay, this is real time real world real HVAC simplified so you want to save these actually you know what I like to do I'm gonna put a little bit of leak lock on these caps This here. The bottle don't want to open, hold on. Pressure is ramping up too. Again, this is real world, real HVAC simplified. We go inside and check our temperature a little bit. Make your wrench. It's colder than that, 45. Yeah, so it's 45 degrees outside apparently. Let's see what we got, fellas. getting warm it's not there yet it's at eight degrees it's just started and this is taking the surface temperatures so that's the blower wheel right there now it's, the heat is coming up I'll give it some time but if you like this video you know give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel subscribe and here i don't think we have to hide any gas to this system here because it's a short run. Whatever came from the factory should be good enough. As a matter of fact, let's go check the tags and see 
What does it say in the name tag? Usually we'll tell you. So let's see what it says here. Uh, Two point seven six pounds. Do we have to hide in? Does it show you here? Sometimes they do. Sometimes we get a refer to the user manual or the installation manual. Fan. So it didn't say. Didn't say. All right. I'm going to refer to the manual. So we're going to brushes. This is building. We have about 20 feet of pipe. Feet of pipes, it's a, it's a short run. Okay, so it's going up 95.99. Yeah, I believe we're fine. I don't think we need any gas in this. So, again, I'm gonna refer to the installation booklet or, or manual. But I think with 20 feet of pipe, we should be good. Getting right to the back. Russian refrigerant. So I'm just going three point two eight feet. Fourteen feet. Point two ounce, point two one ounce per feet. Refrigerant charge. Refrigerant charge. Refrigerant recharge. This pipe land is less than twenty. Okay, so if we are less than 25 feet, no refrigerant charges is necessary. As indicated right here, just like I thought. All right, so let's get the final temperatures and pressures. I'm gonna close this video off. So 113, 114. So we are good. Run away. 121. Yeah, and outside is 45 degrees. And inside, well, it's pretty warm in here. But you see the deal. If you like this video, subscribe. I do upload videos on a weekly basis. So there it is. It's 4.30. 32. I just saw my screen right here. That screen scratched. <laughs>